Hello and welcome to a new recipe video. Today I will show you how to make an easy German pork pot roast, Franconian style with beer. Franconia, called Franken in German, is a region in the German state of Bavaria. Growing up, the German-American actress Sandra Bullock spent most of her childhood and early teens in Nuremberg, Franconia, and still speaks fluent German with a slight Franconian accent. You speak German? Mm -hmm. yeah, I speak Deutsch. You do? Yeah. The Franconian pork roast recipe that I will show you today is super easy to make takes very little work and tastes like a vacation in Bavaria. Let me show you the easy steps. In a small bowl, mix salt, pepper, paprika, marjoram, caraway seeds, garlic paste and mustard. And as always, you can find the exact measurements and the printable recipe instructions via the link in the video description. After you mix the spices, brush the tenderloin with your homemade spice mix from all sides and set it aside. I already cubed the onion and melted the butterschmalz. As you can see, the onions don't need to be cubed very fine. Then fry the onions in the butterschmalz over medium heat. Butterschmalz is clarified butter. I have a video recipe on how to make clarified butter at home and will leave the link for the recipe in the video description. Then free up a little space and place the meat into the pot. Make sure to brown the tenderloin from all sides. This will help to keep it juicy. I also already peeled the carrots and cleaned the leek and sliced everything. Now we can just add the vegetables to the pot and fry them for a couple of minutes. Pour the vegetable broth into the pot, then cover it with a lid and simmer it on medium heat for about 45 minutes. The good news, most of the work is already done. There are only a few steps left where we need to add the two ingredients, rye bread and beer, that make this roast so incredible delicious. So, about 45 minutes later, break the rye bread into bite-sized pieces and place it around the meat. Then cover the pot again with the lid and simmer the meat for another 45 to 60 minutes or until the meat reaches about 145 degrees Fahrenheit. Then add the beer to the pot, cover it again and let the meat simmer for the last 15 minutes. It is important to don't add the beer too early or your gravy will not have that rich warm beer flavor. After the 15 minutes simmering time, remove the meat from the pot and keep it warm. I already blended the liquid with all the vegetables and the soft bread with an immersion blender, but you could also transfer everything to a processor bowl and blend it to a smooth gravy. The gravy should be thick and creamy. If not, add a slurry consistent of 1 tablespoon of cornstarch and 2 tablespoons of cold water. Add it to the gravy, bring it to a boil and let the gravy simmer until it has your desired thickness. In the meantime, slice the meat into about finger thick slices. Serve the Franconian roast with potato dumplings boiled potatoes or just a slice of fresh rye bread. Look how nicely moist and tender the meat is. I really love that recipe. Bavarian sauerkraut, red cabbage or cabbage salad make traditional sides, but a pea and carrot side dish is a wonderful addition too. Guten Appetit!